Well, I don't even really like the word home. I wouldn't call it. I wouldn't call it home. I would call I would it. Say, I would um, say they're really experienced in the art of promiscuity. They're really experienced in the art of promiscuity. People that hump good. What? No, we good. We just. But we know we always right, be so rambling listen. when it starts. All right, listen. Uh, what's up? I'm Preach. We appreciate you guys tuning in for So What You Think podcast. We love the support. Today we're gonna be discussing. Y'all ready for it? You ready? <laughs> this is real love, controversial. Everyone really controversial. loves hoes, all right? Because y'all do. I feel like there's a certain standard, and not everyone loves hoes. We don't want to call them hoes, but I would say everyone loves professional pleasers, and I don't want to call them hoes, Mac. I'm going to say, look, man, we can call them hoes. We can call them ratchets. We can call them whatever. And I don't even mean uh, female <laughs> specifically. I mean male or female. But those are the type of people that we've been trained to like, whether it's James Bond. He always had all the women, like all the people that so we've been. James Bond was a hoe. Yeah, James Bond was a hoe. He had women, like he had a yeah. different uh, shaking cat. us, yeah, cats yeah. And octopus shaking us, and... and... okay. third. Every movie he had a different woman, I Chef, uh, like all of our uh, heroes. Then if you want to go with Marilyn Monroe. We celebrate, we celebrate, no, we celebrate male hoes. We, we drag female hoes. Me myself. So? True, true. I, publicly. I like, publicly, but I deep like down, men really still love, love hoes. We love, everybody loves Nicki Minaj. Everybody loves Little Kim. Uh, we love Cardi B. We love the whole mentality. Like, no. This is what I believe. I, I believe I'm, everybody loves hoes. Just nobody want to live with one. That's so what it comes down to. You want one <laughs> across the street. People want one to go. Don't nobody want to actually have to deal with all the. The, the <laughs> mischief that come with a hoe. So we want our people's said, seasons. We, we want our know, seasons lovers. We we want, I like my men season. I want to speak a little hoe on There you go. So it's we not like it's not like everybody loves hoes. Everyone likes the, yeah, appeal, not really the sexual hoes. appeal that they have. Okay, so we're going to say we are sexually driven people. Can okay. we, all, yeah, we're we can all agree we on that. We want somebody who has experience that we don't have to hold their uh, hand. And I mean, I don't mind teaching a man what I like. Because every, because of course you disagree. No, what I'm saying is like, okay, you want somebody I like, who's I like, undercover. I like, I like a woman that has standards. Yes. All right. I like a woman that's experienced that know what she's doing. Of okay. course, who, who doesn't like that? Okay. But when I think about hoes, I'm thinking, man, back in the day, all the homies that ran through all the women, right? Mm-hmm. We we was she was probably cool as a tomboy, but there ain't somebody you're gonna be like, yo, I'm gonna take her to like a sophisticated establishment. You know what I'm saying? Right. But I believe the reason why that you do that. Is because society has trained you that these are certain type of people that you're not supposed to deal with. Right. But I've this is this is my defense. History. Have you been a gigolo? Have I been a gigolo? Hell yeah. I have uh, bargained my meat stick for. <laughs> for <laughs> when I was young. I was doing it for Jordans, you know, <laughs> Wendy's. <laughs> I, I didn't know my worth. I didn't know my worth. I didn't know my, my worth. Exactly. I was like, look, oh, you, no. if, you, if you can give me some shoes and bring me some Wendy's on your way over here. Because oh, right, that's look, the case, we not McDonald's. That's not McDonald's. That to me, I was look, Long John Silver's, Wendy's, that was $7 value meal back so, in the 90s. Back that, if that's the case, that's then we all done like some whole t- some I whole held like for some whole like whole like activities. I wasn't because giving up McDonald's. If though. a man pays a bill, whether he's your man or whether he's just somebody you're keeping company with, if he's contributing to your household, that could be considered as being a house. Listen, all relationships, male and female, in our society we live in are transactional. Let's do this. Can we agree let's, on that? Let's, let's define what is a hoe. I don't really know. I agree. It's, it's, I disagree. It's, it's a gray area. It's a gray area. Really, it depends. I'm going to tell a, you, it depends on who talking. Like, if it's an uptight grandma at church, she going to call you a hoe bluesy. just for having your dress, Jezebel. your skirt fit too tight, or not having on pantyhose. Like, look at that hoe. Don't even have pantyhose on. But then, if it's like a married woman, she might just judge all single women. They could all be hoes. So it but, all depends. But in our generation, a hoe is somebody who has high vagina mileage. If you're or, coochie, or oh, if your coochie has, oh, if you if you've been ran ran through, so like okay, <laughs> I she about to break it down. Come on, see they would, Every woman has what we consider as a whole season. That oh, we don't okay. want to be a, we don't want to be committed. We just want to have fun. We want to hang out with our homegirls. We want to do what women do. 
And so in that wait, wait, wait. in that time out. <laughs> when, you, when you say when you do what women do, what do you mean by that? What does that mean? It's, I'm just saying we just please do... elaborate. Talk <laughs> talk dirty to me. <laughs> On that I'm tweet. just saying when we when we do what we want to do, we might you know we go out, we go to the club, we might hook up, you know it might be a one nighter here and there. Uh, that might just be me and my girls. Okay, I don't know. Mm. But a lot of times, like in my situation, you could say I'm busy. I'm busy a lot, so I don't want a relationship. I don't want to be settled down. So I will keep a couple of guys for <laughs> not just sex, not just sex. <laughs> But for elaborate, clear that up. For money, your inbox not for money, not for money, money. Okay. not for money either. Because okay. I do my own thing. But okay. for your for your company, for your company, whether I want to go out and have a, just to be social with, okay. or if I want to go out and have drinks, just with you know, hang out with you because you need. I don't care what anybody says. I don't care what any woman says. I don't need a man. It's a whole lie. That's the biggest lie told by any so let me woman. Ask a question. So me and Mac gonna have this conversation. So why is it that you think that everyone loves hoes then? Because they know what they doing. Because uh, his, I feel like if you just look at everything objectively, if you take away all the BS, okay. that's what I really see. I see people who will leave. Uh, no one's staying with somebody if the sex isn't right. Can we agree on that? We can agree. On that. I think that's the biggest crock of bullshit. No, no, I actually, I take that back. No, wait, 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 hold I on. I think that's the biggest Your first, wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. I was so saying this. I was let's saying stop. This. Do on, you agree on. or disagree I think that if you are not enjoying the sex, you will not be around? It would depends. It depends. Because, because when you talk about intimacy, there's different layers of intimacy. That is true. All right? And so we say there's different layers of intimacy. There are some things that's built on the foundation that's a little bit stronger in regards to the relationship than sex, all right? So that is true. Exactly. So it can be sex like every Later. couple weeks, every three, four weeks. May not necessarily be consistent, but hold on, hold on, pick me, pick me, pick me, pick me. New hold combo. On. Hold on. Time hold out. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Time hold on. out. Hold on, man. <laughs> let me let me let me speak my truth real quick. Let me speak my truth, all right? But if you understand the foundation of a relationship, something that's deep and intimate, it's it's, it's regarded as something more than just sex. Now. I would say on the other end, there are some people that are with people just because the sex is bomb. I mean, conversation Listen. is terrible. Uh, they're abusive. They're toxic. But the sex happens to be something that's keeping them there. Let me I tell do you. understand it. Let me tell you. They are full of shit. I heard this. They are I, full of I shit. heard through his conversation, he said something about a couple times in a month. Yeah, it may not be. Cause it, okay, I'm saying That's it. not healthy. I'm going to tell you right now. That's not healthy. Maybe... The hoe in me cannot be pleased by that. <laughs> I, I love you, baby. <laughs> no, like, the, the, reality it is, the reality of it is <laughs> that in a relationship, I, I could be his peace. I could be his fire. I could be the, the homemaker that go. he needs See me that. to be. And that's, that's the, that's, that boy outweighs that my sex is, you know, I might only want yes, to do life missionary. Is, life I might, I might not want to put my ass in the air and do a doggy style. I might not want to get on top. I might feel self-conscious, but... Everything else I bring to the table outweighs right. the fact that I might be frigid. I'm not. Okay, just so we can put that those up. Those are all very, I'm not. So we, listen. Those are all very good <laughs> points. But I know, I see people who, everyone who I know, have, everybody that I know has a, a old friend that they keep around. So they who your old friend? I, <laughs> except me. What's his name? I'm like the I only person know. who I know that doesn't have Because you friends. got standards for yourself. Because I have standards. There but go. everyone else in my life I know, they have whole friends that they keep in contact with. So they can Everybody hear all goes through a whole period, though. I yeah, be actually believe you're, no good, you're not even good marriage material unless you've been through your whole phase. Yeah. Because it's going to happen. Everybody's Somebody should wife me then. Because blah. Because <laughs> what? <'Cause laughs> you, marry, marry me. Right. See the way marry it is now. Me. Look, you can't be in a whole loop. <laughs> <laughs> that be a face. It can't be a loop. Listen, <laughs> I'm stuck in a whole loop. There is oh nothing God. more freeing. Now, women are, are are trained to not be. Um, See, that's why I said that. the word "home." Okay, with, with okay with sexuality. With their own sexuality, right. like women are not supposed that to is. desire to have sex. Women are not supposed to talk about the fact that we masturbate. Women right. are supposed to talk about the fact that we like we like to give hair or, or get right. hair. We're not and see, when it. I was so, talking about so hoes, that's that. the kind of stuff I was okay. talking about because okay. in a lot of that's what that's what we determined as a whole. Because in I'm, a lot of uh, like religious right. people that were raised religiously, 
they would consider all those things uh, ho-ish, ho-ish right. even though it might just be normal so I would sexual say, expression. So I would say lack of education because within the context of a healthy relationship, I mean, a person that's comfortable within their own sexuality is definitely going to have more of a successful relationship. Let me tell you what a hoe in my family right. told me once. It's, it's not but that don't make you a hoe. No, she was a hoe. She no, it doesn't. She slept that's with everybody's man. She slept with everybody's man. But some, she said to me, in whatever context we was having this conversation, that she said sometimes it's just about penis and vagina. She didn't say that. She said, I know Tori going to blue, 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 but P U Y. So sometimes that's what all it's about. It's not about. You should have just said pussy. <laughs> well, Tori, Tori going to blank me out. So sometimes that's not what it was about when she would screw a man. She said at that point in time, she had a, she had a urge that she needed to fulfill. And if your man was there, it wasn't that she was trying to take your happiness. She wasn't trying to take anything. And so we would label her as a hoe, but she was as she was realer than any of us. She was realer than anybody I knew because she let it be known. This is what she wanted to do. <laughs> what are you saying? But the definitions of a hoe are so, the area is so gray because we call men hoes because they, they sleep around. Um, and that's, they have to be ex, like extreme sleep around but we have a if we have a woman who is openly ab- talking about her sexual needs mm-hmm. even if she she could have five partners in her mm-hmm. whole life but because she's open and she's sexually free right. she's a whore which ah. goes back to our previous topic when we were talking about double standards there are double standards in the world in the world and I'm sometimes sexually it, free I don't mind talking about the things I like to and because do. you are sexually free there are some people who will call you a hoe okay. are you aware of that Fight me. <laughs> do, you, do, you, do you own it though? I own it. Come I don't. I own it. I don't. I don't. I don't sugarcoat it. I don't. I don't. I don't try to be something that I'm not. Now, what I will do. What I will say. The only thing that I do is I've never, because I've seen it in my peers where like, I was in high school and a girl got picked on because her mama was loose. What's her and name? She, I'm not telling you. Say her name. <laughs> She's You're not snitching. Hey, old girl that she went to school with. <laughs> we forgot. Whatever. <laughs> But what I'm saying is I would never put that, I would never want that to be something that goes back on my kids. So you right. still have to be, even though I'm free and safe. Yeah, because everybody also hates hoes too. It's a, it's a, they love, it's a weird it's a balance. Love, hate relationship. It's the same way like with black people. It's the same. They're like, we love us, hate us, same way with hoes. <laughs> they feel the same way. It's like, we love, it's a love-hate relationship. They want you, everybody likes, like if you're going to advertise your beer, you want some girls to look like hoes. If you're going to advertise your your club flyer, you're going to have some whole looking mm-hmm. people on there. Yeah, and that's going to attract males and females. That's why I'm saying, right. when I say yeah. everybody loves hoes, I'm saying if we just step back and look beyond what we say with our mouths, we yeah. use sex to advertise everything. Everything. We're going to show so women barely dressed, hoes. not even hoes. I mean, everyone likes women that we appeal. would call correct. I don't right. even use, uh, I'm using the word the way. Judgmental people will use it, oh, not the way okay. that I actually right. feel about people. But we're right. going to use sex to sell Everybody. beer, right. insurance, hair. hamburgers, hair. Nails, but at the same everything. time, we will judge people for being sexual Drugs when everything insurance. about our world <laughs> is anti. actually is, is sex. Right. So we live in the constant conflict and right. we live in the constant. But people don't want to know the personal. State. They don't want a personal person around them. No, that nobody really wants to be around absolute. hoes, but everybody loves hoes from a distance. Right. So when I say that, I'm not saying we all love them even in our mind or I consciously. Love them. But, I love them. But you secretly, love everything that I we do them. is revolved around <laughs> everything that is packed to us is sexuality. Even if you want to look at even uh, religion, even right. the virgin slash she's pregnant. So is she a hoe or is she pure? Right. Like everything is presented to us in those ways. Right. I just present it in a way we say everybody loves hoes to make it sound more shocking. It's just because everybody has a definition of what they consider a hoe. And it only really means you down to do more than I'm down to do. That's how we decide who Your freak level. Your freak level. Your freak level. You know, if you you came to Mac on show, you know there's freak levels. I determined that I'm a... I'm a, I'm a, I'm a I'm nine. A and a half. I'm a nine. To and I'm judging everybody. I'm going to judge people that's a little, that's nines and tens. I'm going to judge them. And nines and tens going to judge down. That's just how the world works. That's man. just how we work. We basically all judges, judgmental. We all hypocrites. And y'all all love hoes. I you just don't hoes. want nobody to know. Yeah. You want a hoe in private. When they said we don't love them hoes, they lie. Right, we appreciate lie. you guys tuning in. Tell us what y'all think about this, man. Comment down below. Like it. 
Tell me if you like hoes, if you don't like hoes, what you think about the whole concept of <laughs> this education. Give us a definition of what you consider a hoe. What even your definition is? Share this with your pastor. Ask him what he thinks. <laughs> Share this with the woman who runs the kitchen at the church. Right. She knows everything. And I guarantee she knows everything. Right. She runs the kitchen at the church. Hey, right, what's up, man? This is Preach. I'm back home. I'm T Dot. Pray for us. <laughs> No, 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 I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I don't need all y'all prayers. And you knock on wood too. Keep that shit. Somebody might be praying that I get some vagina comfort like you saw my vagina down. And I know. If you got a booty dollar, put some money in his pockets. Put some money in his pockets.